We were going away for the weekend the other day. I knew I had packages coming in and I didn't know where they were coming from. I knew the curiosity was going to kill me and I wouldn't enjoy my weekend. So we pulled up next to the mailman. I asked him for my packages. He knows my face already. He handed me a few things, including this. I was kind of like shocked because it said it was from Ipsy, but I'm like, it's not my paid box. It's not the PR box. What is it? Girl, when I opened it up, they sent me a Too Faced palette. And I truly was like, okay, why would they send me a Too Faced palette? Like, yay, I don't already own the palette, but why would they send me the palette? Now, you know, BoxyCharm and Ipsy have officially merged. If you go to BoxyCharm.com, it automatically takes you over to the Ipsy website. And if you have an active BoxyCharm account, or even if it's inactive, you should be able to log into ipsy.com with your BoxyCharm credentials. I don't think it applies to everyone quite yet. I think they're still doing the transition, but more and more people are able to just log in with your BoxyCharm credentials over at the Ipsy app and or the website and start to see your product. By the way, the April choice, Here's the thing, BoxyCharm would always do things a little differently. BoxyCharm would allow you to make your April choice in March, and then you have to wait a month, month and a half to get your box. And every month it's the same. You choose this month for next month. Ipsy does it completely differently. And so with Ipsy, you make your April choices in April, you wait about a week and a half, and then you get your product. So. This process is gonna be something that everyone is going to love more than the way BoxyCharm used to do it because I myself would make my choice selections and totally forget what in the world I chose. Whereas with Ipsy, you don't have to wait that long, which is actually pretty exciting. Now reading the card, they sent over a cell phone charm. I don't know how to use this, you know, cause my cell phone is here. So where would this, I'm not sure. I'm going to Google it. How stinking cute is this? And it says Ipsy would go so, maybe up here. It goes somewhere and then you can kind of carry your phone. This it's so cute though. Ty thought it was a bracelet. I initially thought it was a bracelet too. And she asked for it. So maybe Ty will take it for her phone. So the card says they're gifting this exclusive phone charm, a bonus beauty boost product and the details back here on the changes in the subscription, which we've already gone through. So if you need the full on breakdown on the changes, what the new names are, what the benefits and perks are, make sure you check out the video that is gonna be linked in the description box below. But this palette, I saw it, I wanted it, and then I was like, you're not gonna run and buy it. Don't do it, don't do it, you have enough palette. This one launched last July, around, it was in the summer for sure. And this is their leveled up 2.0 version of their chocolate palette. I had the chocolate palette, the original, and the peach palette for so long. I ended up decluttering it last year and it hurt me so bad because I loved my palettes. They smell amazing. They smell like chocolate, okay? And even like the chocolate ones kind of tasted a little bit like chocolate, like the fallout would hit me and it was like, mm. You know, so I saw it and I knew that I wanted to get it, but you guys know there's so much makeup rotating in this room and it's hard to get around to playing with everything. So I didn't want to invest the money about me, huh? They said this, so we are going to play with her. Is this going to be the beauty boost product for April? I don't know, but I sure hope so because I feel like a lot of people who don't own the palette would really like it. Anyway, let's go ahead and play around with her. I definitely want to use this shape. There's something about it, it's shift. You know, it's like a multi-chrome-ish. It looks green, it looks blue, it looks purple, it looks a stunning. I want to mix some of this purple into it. So let's get into it. I'm going to go ahead and dip in to Nice Buns, which is this one over here. I'm going to apply that on the greasy crease. Oh my God, it smells so good. This smells so yummy. So when it comes to the Beauty Boost, what happens is you're able to pay $15 additional to your monthly subscription every single month and boost your BoxyCharm by Ipsy box with a premium product. So instead of paying full price for something that's going to be well over 40 bucks, you pay $15 and they will add it to your box. Will we know what that item is in advance? I don't know yet because this is all starting April and I opened my subscription all over again with Ipsy. So instead of getting the Glam Bag Plus, now I'm gonna get the BoxyCharm by Ipsy. 
And so that's going to give me a paying members experience, the behind the scenes. And if you didn't see me unbox my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for March, which is the very last one, we will see with that name. You need to go check it out. That's my paid box. It went up yesterday. And let's just say I love this, but I'm not happy with the size. And I explained why and what I'm doing about it. So, might want to go check out that video. With an eyeshadow brush, I'm going to dip into Bless Your Tart. And I'm tapping that out here. You guys already know how we do things. We're going to go ahead and build it. So, I'm just going to tap, tap, tap. And keep tapping until most of the product is off of the brush and on the elbow. And it's okay to bring it close to the crease. I'm going to take the same brush. I'm going to flip it over. I'm going to use the opposite side for the lavender shade. It's called Sugar Rush. And I'm going to tap that in here. And with a really slim brush, I'm going to dip into this one over here. It's called Midnight Snack. I'm going to look down and I'm going to focus that on the crease. We're going to blend that out, but I just want to deepen the crease a little bit. With the brush we used with the first shade, I'm going to blend that out. You can go in with a clean brush, but I think given the fact that this has a little more product left within it again i didn't tap into the pan or anything this is just with whatever's left it'll help blend that out a little better make it a little softer i'm wiping away any fallout the same brush we used on that deeper matte shade i'm gonna take whatever's left and i'm gonna drag it under the eye and i know i have nothing else on my face you're like how does that make sense it will no worries you already know, trust the process. I'm working backwards and I'm glad because look at all this fallout that I got from the palette. It's beautiful, but can get kind of messy. Black eyeliner on the waterline all the way to the inner corner. You guys, could you imagine if this is actually the Beauty Boost product to snag this palette for just $15 is everything. I had no idea that now, because again, things have changed in the past year, but I had no idea that Ipsy actually updates their shop several times a week if not every single day and add new product so you know i've been on their app a lot lately trying to see if there's anything that i can snag for a great price there's so much that i've like added to cart but then when i eventually go and revisit it's like gone it sells out fast all right you guys i'm gonna go ahead finish off the rest of my face at that point i'm able to add lashes and fine tune the look and i'll be right back I finished off the rest of my face, made sure I applied a decent amount of mascara on the lower lashes. And here is the look. I think it's really pretty. I find that the blue was a little on the crumbly side, which is okay. There was fallout. So if you're ever going to use this palette, get it in the future, get it in a box. Just make sure that you do your eyes first if you're using shimmer shades because they tend to shift and move around. This palette was an unexpected gift from Ipsy. I'm super grateful. So Ipsy, thank you you so much because if this is a glimpse a little sneak peek if you will of what's to come in upcoming boxes then this is a beauty box you're not gonna want to miss out on and you might want to give a second chance now if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing hitting the notification bell and the like button for me please and if you enjoyed this video girl you do not need to leave i have so much content already up on my channel i know you're really going to enjoy i'm suggesting two videos here on screen i think you're really gonna have a good time watching so please consider checking those out and i will see you guys on the next video bye guys